Hey there tech enthusiasts, it's CP here and welcome back to the channel. So in today we are diving into a topic which has been puzzling the Apple fans in India. Why are iPhones often priced higher in India than other countries? So let's uncover the reasons behind the disparity in today's video. The first factor we need to explore is import duties and taxes. So iPhones are primarily made outside India and when they enter the country, they are subjected to import duties which are imposed by the Indian government. And additionally, various taxes including the goods and service tax are levied on electronic devices. So these additional costs are ultimately passed on to the customers which contribute to the higher prices of iPhones in India. It's important to note that these duties and taxes can vary from country to country and India's structure plays a significant role in the price disparity. Now let's discuss another crucial factor, the currency exchange rates. So the value of country's currency relative to others can impact the pricing of imported goods. So fluctuations in currency exchange rates can affect the cost of importing iPhones to India. If the Indian rupee weakens against the other currencies, it can result in the higher prices for imported products like iPhones in India. Currency exchange rates are influenced by various economic factors including the inflation, trade imbalances and global market dynamics which ultimately impact the final retail price of iPhones. And beyond the import duties and taxes and even the currency exchange rates, we need to consider the distribution and operational costs. So Apple has a unique distribution network that includes authorized resellers, service centers, and the Apple stores. These distribution channels come with additional costs such as logistics, warehousing, and maintaining physical retail spaces. And these expenses are often factored into the pricing of iPhones in India. Moreover, operating costs, including market and after-sale support, also contribute to the overall price tag of iPhones. So, so one more aspect to consider is economies of scale. So Apple sells a vast majority of iPhones globally, but the Indian market represents a smaller share compared to the larger markets like the United States or China. And due to the lower sales volume in India, Apple may not achieve the same economies of scale, resulting in a higher unit cost. And to cover these costs, so Apple may adjust the pricing in specific markets to ensure profitability which could explain the higher pricing of iPhone. So lastly, local regulations and policies can also impact the iPhone pricing. So India has a specific regulations regarding foreign direct investments and local sourcing norms in order to, pro in order to promote make in India. So these regulations may require a certain percentage of iPhone products or iPhone components to be made in India. So setting up a local manufacturing facilities can involve additional costs initially which can reflect in the pricing of iPhones in India. However, it's worth noting that Apple has started local manufacturing in India and this initiative could potentially contribute to the to more competitive pricing in future. To sum it up, a higher price pricing of iPhones in India compared to other countries can be attributed to a combination of factors such as the import duties and taxes, the currency exchange rates, distribution and operation costs, economies of scale and local regulations and all these things together play their part in shaping the total pricing landscape. So understanding these factors gives us insights into the complexities of the global market and how they influence the product pricing. We hope this video shed some light on the subject and provided you some useful content and provided you with a better understanding of why iPhones are costly in India. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more insightful content. And as always, feel free to leave your thoughts and comments below. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video very soon.